Hi friends, welcome back. Friends, today we will discuss literary movement, which is very important topic of English literature. Yeah, friend. Literary movements ka matlab kya hota hai? Ye sabse pehle hume samajh lena hoga. Friends, literary movements is related to the dividing literature into categories. Yes, friends. Ye literature ko jo hai kisi ek particular age ke literature ko wo categories mein sab categories mein divide karta hai by the authors or writers of the same age that is called literary movements ye literary movements ke jo main theme jo topic jo related hota hai wo basically based on hota hai their philosophical views their political views whatever things they have written in their work That is related to the literary movements. जैसे हम बात करते हैं 18th century literature की तो आप 18th century literature में आप बहुत से ऐसे literary movements देखोगे जैसे आप कैरलियर पोएट्स देखे देखोगे मेटाफिजिकल पोएट्स देखोगे एंड ऑल्सो अगस्टन द अगस्टन्स के बारे में आप डिस्कस करोगे दी ऑल आर ऑफ द सेम एज बट दे हैव डिफरेंट पॉइंट ऑफ व्यूज रिलेटेड टू दी लिटरेचर दैट इज वाई दिस इज कॉल्ड लिटरेरी मूवमेंट्स वी विल डिस्कस नेक्स्ट each and every literary movements in details so don't skip the video watch it till the so friends here the first literary movements we have cavalier poets cavalier poets belong to the 17th century english royalist poets their main writing zone were properly primarily about courtly love yes friends cavalier poets came from classes that supported king charles i during the english civil war king charles i ko ye poets cavalier poets jo the wo support karte the english civil war ke time pe uh, through their work through their literary works that's why they were called royalist poets yes isiliye unhe royalist poets bola jata hai aur unka main focus jo hua karta tha wo courtly love se related likha karte the courtly manners ke upar uh, likha karte the they were also called the son of ben by the name of ben johnson important authors were robert harry richard lovelace and thomas carew they were the most important writers of the cavalier poets next we have metaphysical poets friends metaphysical poets was a literary movement during the 17th century yes friends their work was mainly focused on or related to the characterized by the inventive use of concise by a greater emphasis on the spoken rather than lyrical quality of their words yes friends their works related to the concise poem and also they used some kinds of images and and also scientific and literary jargon imageries had used by the writers of the metaphysical poets and there were few writers of this age or of this movement who only used to write works related to the themes like uses of paradox or puns and also uses of uh, metaphysical concites uses of scientific imageries these were the main important themes of the metaphysical poets and john don is the foremost figure that's why john this word metaphysical was first coined by the critic and poet samuel johnson samuel johnson ne se first time isko ye word metaphysical khoja tha unhone first time unhone खोज रखा था निकाला था एंड जॉन डन इसके बहुत ही फोरमोस्ट फिगर थे बहुत ही इंपॉर्टेंट पोएट थे इस लिटरेरी मूवमेंट्स के एंड ऑल्सो अलॉन्ग विदेम अलॉन्ग विद हिम जॉर्ज हर्बर्ट एंड्रू मॉर्वेल एब्राहम कॉले रिचर्ड क्रॉसा एंड हेनरी वॉगन दीज ऑल आर दी फ्रॉम मेटाफिजिकल मूवमेंट्स एंड दी ऑल आर कार कॉल्ड मेटाफिजिकल पोएट्स विथ जॉन डन नेक्स्ट वी हैव गोथिक नॉवेल gothic novel often deals with supernatural elements yes friend events or elements uh, friends gothic novels was also a kind of literary movements and is often deals with the theme of supernatural events 
also fear there were the elements of fear horror death gloom and also nature and that cannot be easily explained or over which man has no control yes friends and it's top uh, typically follows a plot of suspense and mystery yes the plot of the gothic novel deals with the suspense and mystery because it has death blood fear horror death all these things सुपर नेचुरल एलिमेंट्स जो थे वो गोथिक नॉवल में ज़्यादा यूज किए जाते थे उसमें सस्पेंस होता था उसके प्लॉट में और मिस्ट्रीज हुआ करते थे और सुपर और नेचर का उसमें कोई कंट्रोल नहीं हुआ करता था दैट्स वाई दिस इज कॉल्ड गोथिक नॉवल एंड होरेस वॉल पोल्स गोथिक नॉवल इज द कैशल ऑफ ओट्रेंटो दिस इज वेरी फेमस नॉवेल विच इज बिलोंग टू द कैटेगरी ऑफ गोथिक नॉवेल्स विच वॉज रिटन बाय होरेस वॉलपोल एंड ऑल्सो क्लैरा रीव and radcliffe william thomas backford and matthew lewis were important authors of gothic novel they were the important novelist of the gothic novel related movement next movement we have lake poets lake poets were a group of english poets who all lived in the lake districts of इंग्लैंड येस फ्रेंड्स वी ऑल आर फेमिलियर विद लेक पोएट्स हम सभी फेमिलियर हैं लेक पोएट्स से एंड लेक पोएट्स वो ग्रुप ऑफ इंग्लिश पोएट्स का था जो लेक डिस्ट्रिक्ट ऑफ इंग्लैंड यू के में यूनाइटेड किंगडम में रहा करते थे इन दी फर्स्ट हाफ ऑफ दी नाइनटीन सेंचुरी येस फ्रेंड्स दोएट्स ऑफ दिस ग्रुप बिलोंग्स टू दी लेक डिस्ट्रिक्ट ऑफ इंग्लैंड ऑफ यूनाइटेड किंगडम ऑफ दी फर्स्ट हाफ ऑफ दाइनटीन सेंचुरी एंड दी पोएट्स three figure of this group were william wordsworth samuel chelles coleridge st coleridge and robert southey these are the lake poets this is the group of the lake poets who came to known as the lake poets in english literature they are very famous aur ye romantic age se belong karte the lake district mein raha karte the england ke lake district mein raha karte the sabhi inka naam लेक पोएट के रूप में फेमस हुआ इन दी रोमांटिक एरा नेक्स्ट वी है मूवमेंट यस फ्रेंड्स दिस इज आल्सो वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट लिटरेरी मूवमेंट ऑफ इंग्लिश लिटरेचर द प्री रेफलाइट वर अ सीक्रेट सोसाइटी ऑफ यंग फाउंड आर्टिस्ट फाउंडेड इन लंदन इन 1848 बाय विलियम होलमैन हंट यस फ्रेंड्स विलियम होलमैन हंट वॉज दी फाउंडर ऑफ दिस सोसाइटी प्री रेफलाइट जैसे रेफेल के नाम पे ये पड़ा हुआ है जो कि बहुत ही बड़े ग्रेट पेंटर थे दैट्स वाई ये प्री रेफलाइट इनको बोला जा रहा है इनके और ये यंग आर्टिस्ट हुआ करते थे जो कि पेंटर्स हुआ करते थे जिसमें और ये पोएट्स हुआ करते थे ये लंदन में ये मोमेंट या ये सोसाइटी को खोजा गया था विलियम होल डब्ल्यू एच हंट के द्वारा दिस ग्रुप वॉज मेन कॉन्सेप्ट वॉज रिलेटेड टू दिस्ट्री ऑफ पेंटिंग एंड इमिटेशन ऑफ नेचर एज सेंट्रल पर्पज ऑफ आर्ट ये फ्रेंड्स पेंटिंग एंड नेचर ऑफ वॉज द सेंट्रल एंड मेन थीम ऑफ द वर्क ऑफ दीज पोएट्स एंड जो इनका एक मेन मिशन हुआ करता था दे वी आर मेनली फोकस्ड ऑन टू प्योरिफाई दी आर्ट ऑफ इट्स टाइम आर्ट ऑफ द नाइनटीन सेंचुरी by returning to the early renaissance painting yes in ka tha ki whatever is going on in the society they wanted to purify that things and they through the through their painting and through their natural art most important writers or uh, authors of this movement were john everett miller dan dg rosti dante gabriel rosti he was the most famous uh, author of this literary movement william mechel Rossi James Collinson Collinson Frederick George Stephen and Thomas Woolner they were the they who formed the seven member of brotherhood yes this was also known as the free referite brotherhood these group of seven members known as free referite brotherhood in english literature next we have the augustans this was also a literary movement an 18th century literary movement based chiefly on classical ideal satire and skepticism yes friends the augustans were mainly focused on the theme related to the 
classical ideas of the roman and greek authors they were imitated the style of greek and roman authors and also satirizes the vices and follies of corruption of the current society of the 18th century and most important author was alexander pope alexander pope was also the representative poet of the augustan age and also another writer was jonathan jonathan swift so friends this was all we had in today's video this was the first part of the literary movement and we have not covered all important literary moments in this video in my next video you will get few other literary moments of english literature which was very important so friends keep watching english zone thank you very much for watching this